So I'm going to Zoo Tools, Scatter Plot, and then we want to plot distance versus velocity. And we will add a linear trend line. And this will be helpful because once we make the scatter plot with the linear trend line automatically fit to it, you can actually just hover over that and see um, it's a very small. I don't have a great way to zoom in on that. Let's see, there, it's a little bit better maybe. So if you just hover over the line, it'll actually tell you the slope of the line. I'm not sure if it does this after you send it to the sheet, but it definitely does here. So note down our slope. You might want to write down the whole linear equation there. Um, it's an equation for line y equals mx plus b, where the slope m is 65.8. And b is not super important, but here it's 1146. All right. So once you have produced this scatter plot with trend line, um, you can click Send to Sheet. And it'll add a tab of charts here for you. So that could be helpful for including in your results section of a lab report. You'll do the results section this week in the forum. So you'll want to make sure to um, do this with the chart so that then you can, uh, you can actually copy and paste it or you can go to these three dots and download as a PNG. And that way you can upload it to the forum. If you want to just, you know, sketch it and uh, kind of sketch the result and take a picture of it and upload that to Moodle instead, that's fine. I don't really care. Whatever's easy for you. But this might be handy for future labs as well.